Hi guys, welcome back. Now we are going to discuss about what is from what is to method in the Apache Camel. Okay, so what basically from is doing, what basically to is doing. Okay, so let's go into router class actually. So what is from? What basically will do in the router? Okay, so from is nothing but actually. So for example, you are having one application. Okay, so you are having two applications basically A and B. Okay, so A is producing the data and B wants the data. In between, you are using Apache Camel, right? So it means that you are consuming the data from A. Okay, so let me give some more detail if you want. Obviously, it will be helpful. Okay, let me. You can see here. This is application A. Okay, maybe let me tell it as a producer. Correct. So obviously you should have some consumer. Consumer, right? Okay. So in between, you are developing application called Apache Camel, right? Okay, so the producer application is there and the consumer application is there. Okay, so they they don't know how to interact between them, right? So because producer is producing the data with the REST API format. Okay, maybe just assume that REST API. Okay, it is producing. This will consume in maybe uh, what is that some uh, XML format or whatever it may be. Okay, just just assume that. Okay. So in between that, so your Apache Camel is coming into picture, right? So it is trying to capture the data from producer and it can give to consumer, right? This is what basically we'll, we are going to do it out, right? So this that is what Apache Camel we are using. Okay, right. So let me come into example. So from means you need to mention this system details, okay? So how this system can interact, okay? And in the two, this is the from router. Sorry, okay. This is the from router dot two. Okay, this is the endpoint. Okay, so this is the from. This is the end two. Two is the endpoint. You need to mention. You need to mention about your consumer. This guy details. Okay, so as of now, for the first, as it is the first step, what I'm going to do, okay, so let me, the from, we are having in the Apache Camel, we are having a system called timer, we are having component called timer, okay, so what basically the timer will do, it is, it will treat as a, you just, you, you can assume as a producer application, okay, timer will call every time, it will produce every time, okay, so the timer is a component okay so just i am giving any method so let me give you a test okay so every 5 seconds it it should get called so 5000 5, i am giving 5000 milliseconds so 5 seconds every 5 seconds it should get called okay and it should go and i have another component called log so you are trying to integrate two components one is timer and the another one is log okay so in the log, I'm trying to produce the data, right? Whatever data I want, I can produce it. Just I'm giving some test dummy on, okay? Don't think much, okay? So see, once I save it, it is coming. So now you can see again, route startup total zero and started zero. I have a route now from his own route, right? So this is called one router, router class. So we have one route basically, but why still again it is 0.0, .0 okay? We need to make sure we need to add an annotation called at component. If you are annotating component so that your Spring Boot application knows that, okay, I have a class. Okay, I, I need to use it out Spring Boot stereotype. Make sure you are selecting that, not camel one. You need to select Spring Boot. 
so because this annotation is for spring boot once you give it you can see that see total route is one and started one right so now you can see that difference right okay so every five seconds see it is it is calling that the timer is getting called and it is printing something it is giving the body as null okay let me try to set some body okay basically so that we can try to so after received the from i am trying to do some body i am trying to set some body values okay so to set the body value you can we can use a method called symbol okay so just i am giving as a welcome to tech bus blocks okay let me just save it once i save it automatically it should re restarted okay so again it's restarted and tom got 8080 one router now you can see that my body type is string and body value is welcome to tech bus blocks right so in apache camel it is having lot of components okay now what i done is that one is timer component okay so the a components i am treating as a timer component okay this is nothing but a timer component okay timer component and this is a logger log component okay so in between that okay so so i am using apache camel i am consuming from here so using what is that using from and i'm just trying to pass the value to 2 using 2 and in between i'm just setting the body right and along with it the body whatever i'm setting that also passing to the 2 router right so that you can able to see the log right so whatever i is just sent from from it is coming here right so every 5 seconds it is printing the logs so hope you understood what is from and to right what is the purpose of that in router right maybe if you are using mq so from what is the queue you need to consume that that you can give it in from what is the queue you should you should produce the data you can give it in two okay maybe in between that if you, if you want to play with some data you can go for your set body or you can uh, understand you can go for your processor or whatever it may be okay now in this video hope you understood what is from and to right Thanks guys, thanks for watching. Bye bye.